Good morning, boys. Here's the kayak, just like I promised. The only thing is, we don't have the trolling motor mounted on because I still haven't managed to get a battery. But anyways, let's go ahead and leave the boat ramp and get this fishing day started. Right now, all I'm doing is fishing in open water, but I might go to like a couple of points. I know there's a bridge further down here and I want to try going around there. Even if I can get to like a, a smaller cut where the channel's at, I know I should have some pretty good luck around that area. Let's go ahead and start making our way that way. Okay, see, so here's one spot I wanted to try when I seen it on Google Maps. So pretty much this is just like a little cut going into the marsh and coming back to this bridge. That's the reason I wanted to fish it, just because it's kind of like like a narrowed spot, almost like a highway that fish have to use. I think I just seen some birds diving back there. I cast it out to the center and now I'm just gonna kind of fan cast this area, just see if I get anything. If I don't, well then we'll end up moving down to another spot, no problem. Ah, I got stuck, that's fine. Kind of anchored to it. We'll get over there and adjust. Beautiful. Wow. I love kayak fishing. I don't lose as much gear. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a fish. Yes, sir. Oh, sick. I just seen that look good, so I just made one cast at it. Oh yeah. Oh sick dude. Look at that little little baby redfish. He was just sitting there waiting for me. Check that out boys. We got one small tiny redfish. But hey man, it's it's the first catch of the day. I caught him just kind of sitting right here in this little area where there's like a cove that goes backwards. I was like, you know what, let me just make one cast at it through the down south and Literally on the first cast right there, he, he bit at it. Small little guy. See you later, buddy. Okay, cool. <laughs> so this current that's picking up right here, it's actually pretty hefty. So look, <laughs> we already made it all the way back to the beginning. Let's keep, let's keep trekking this way, guys. There we go. There's a fish. <laughs> I was really just trying to pay attention to this boat to make sure he didn't hit me and a little sand trout bit it right there. Smaller fish, but still fish. Look at that, boys. Small sand trout on the voodoo shrimp. Guys, I think we messed around enough over there hitting the houses. So we're gonna start going toward the marsh system. Uh, where we're at right now, we're gonna keep coming down this bend and we should end up at the main entrance to the marsh. All the while what we're gonna be doing, oh, see, there was something right here. All the while what we're gonna be doing is just, you know, using our eyes, see if we can see any fish coming by. I don't know how this happens and I don't know if you can see it but I just got caught in the only rain cloud that's in the whole Galveston area. Look at this. I'm getting freaking rained on right now. I mean granted I knew I was gonna get wet being here already but dude what? Come on. I don't know what this is man. I, I swear like you can see right behind me I got blue skies and above me is one cloud that's just gray. How do I get stuck in this? I'm not trying to get any of this stuff messed up. Just gotta wait it out. Don't let the GoPro get wet. The good thing is you always bring a dry bag when you come out. Now give me a second, I'll put you on the dry bag real quick. Look at all of this movement around me. I don't know what this is. It's gotta be mullet, but this spot, is, look at it, it's so, so grassy that every time I make a cast, it's gotta be just mullet because I mean, oh, 
Dang bird, you almost got whacked. Yeah, let's see. Just gotta leave them all there. Even my lure staying right on top. Well, quick update, boys. It just stopped for now, but dude, he just got dumped on. I seen the rain coming in at a distance and I had to hurry up, grab all my GoPro, grab all my stuff and just throw it in the dry bag, man. Thank God I have this bag because if not, I would have wrecked everything. I would have wrecked my phone. I would have wrecked every single little bit of camera equipment that I have. But man, it was, oh my God, it was awful. It was awful. I think that's the worst kind of storm I've ever been in and didn't even have any cover. I kind of I kind of want to call it a day but I don't want to leave the video with just those small little fish that I caught so I'm gonna still stay out here a little bit longer just to see if I can get anything there goes a the fish there goes a the fish there we go oh it was worth the wait what kind of fish is this Oh my God, <laughs> guys, it's a little red fish. Thank goodness. Oh my God. The GoPro's messing up like always. So I got you guys on my knee and on my hat. So look at this. All right, to you guys, this is nothing, right? This is just a little tiny red fish. But to me, this guy might, <laughs> this might just be the most rewarding fish that I think I've ever caught. We had a hard time in the back lakes and man after that storm came by i didn't think i was going to get anything and that's kind of rewarding look at his tail that's rewarding man it really is i got dumped on today dude nothing really went for my favor but look at him we're gonna still stay out here a little bit longer we're not too far away from the boat ramp so let's keep doing it man let's keep doing it let's keep grinding it out and let's send this guy back on his way thanks for biting buddy seriously This GoPro's fucked. You know what? I don't have time for this shit. I'm gonna fix this shit at the house. Oh, there's a fish right there, boys. Oh, he spit it out. Looked like a trout. Dang it. There it goes. Oh, no. He let it go. Oh, dang, that was a good fish. That was a lot better one. Oh, man, dude, dang it. That would have been a keeper right there. I know for a fact it would have been. He actually, look, he ripped my voodoo shrimp right off of here. Wow. I'm not sure what the guy was, but you know what? I know exactly where he was the first time. Let me see if I can hook into him again. Thank you, boys, for staying to the end of this video. I really, really appreciate it. We will be having a store where we'll be selling some shirts like this, the Snook Chasing Bait. If you guys like it, let me know. If you don't, also let me know. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Once again, I will see y'all later. Boom!